later, about 10 years ago, when I was working on the antibiotic resistance and prescribing in European children project. When I first joined Penta, I was told, you have to realize joining Penta is like joining a family. You get love, support, discussion, laughter and tears. And most importantly, you will never be able to leave. But also, why would you want to? When I first joined, I was totally awestruck by the sheer intellectual prowess gathered in Penta. These were people who really knew how to answer questions about best treatment of infections in children. When you join Penta, you have to expect to get challenged. What is the question? Is this the best way to answer the question that you're wanting to address? But if you're onto something good, boy will you get support. Since joining Penta, I have been given the amazing opportunity to investigate various ways of improving treatment for children who suffer from bacterial infection. Bacteria are a specific kind of bug and they're usually treated with antibiotics. Sometimes when bacteria are exposed again and again to antibiotics, they don't respond to them very well anymore. And that makes treatment very challenging. Arguably, bacterial resistance is one of the most important health threats to child health globally today. Penta is working in various aspects to address this problem. We are both involved in trials um, that look to improve the antibiotic treatment of newborns with infection. These are children who are very vulnerable and if they are infected with bacteria not responding to antibiotics anymore, they can be harmed greatly or even die. Penta also does various trials looking at the best treatment of children with chest and other severe infections. And lastly, Penta is looking to prevent babies and children from acquiring these bacteria who don't respond well to antibiotics anymore. This research is very challenging because children here tend to be acutely unwell. So there's not a lot of time for clinicians or parents to deliberate about contributing to research. This is quite different to other infections such as HIV or tuberculosis, where generally there is a little bit more time um, for decision making. So it is really important to have excellent support networks to do this kind of research because you have to get it right the first time and you have to make sure that the burden is minimal for children and their families. If you do get it right though, then you can answer questions that can literally save the lives of millions of children around the world. So thinking back to myself 10 years ago, it is true to say that I've never wanted to leave Penta. So in that sense, I've joined a family and I'm very glad that I did. I did get all the things that I was promised, support, love, discussion, laughter and tears. And I'm hoping that further generations of researchers who join Penta will be able to profit from the same. So I am now trying to nurture um, young researchers to come and join this family and in addition to all the positive experiences that I've made, one of the things that I am sure that they will all encounter is great inspiration. At Penta, you can literally stand on the shoulders of giants to address questions that are of importance for um, children's health all over the world. And I cannot think of a better way to improve the lives and make sure that children can be healthy um, and lead fulfilled and long lives um, all over the world. I very much hope that Penta can maintain its important role in child health research. It is an amazing platform to launch very complex and ambitious pro projects. It really fosters innovative approaches. Um, it, it is a platform where you can come, you can find experts, you can engage and you can network with literally everybody.